What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's Coco Sims. I hope y'all like the new intro or whatever. Shout out to my video editing plug, I guess is what you can call it. He killed it. I'm going to link his YouTube in the description box for anybody who wants a dope ass intro like mine, I guess. I was trying to make my own and you know, it wasn't giving what it was supposed to give. It wasn't, it wasn't giving at all. But thank you so, so, so much for making my new intro. Shout out to you. And let's jump right into this video because it's going to be a very long video, okay? So basically what's about to happen is, I know y'all see where we are and I know you guys see Xavion. I know y'all see Javon. I know y'all see a lot of familiar people here. And it's because we're at the fair. I set up this fair myself, but it was it came pre-built by I think Zerbu or somebody child. I don't know. I've been going through a lot lately and I just playing the Sims for relaxation purposes. But I did really miss you guys. I miss you guys so so much. And I just wanted to film a quick little video, but there's not going to be nothing quick about this video because y'all see this? This is a functional I think this is a functional okay. The gas station is not functional, I lied y'all. But these rides and shit are functional. And I know y'all are probably wondering who all of these people are, right? And we gonna get into it. Where the fuck did this Star Wars toy come from? These kids are spoiled. They already got prizes. We ain't even went into the carnival yet. But get a good look at the carnival, y'all. I set up all these little signs by myself. Okay, cash only, no checks, no credit. You're being videotaped, smile, 100 or what does it say? Hundreds of prices lowered. You got the little um, English soldier type thing going on right here. The hours of operation. Everything in here is functional, you guys. And I am obsessed with how it looks in Oasis Springs with my reshade, y'all. This shit is so fucking pretty. But basically, before we even get into introducing these people, let's get into the itinerary okay we have a lot of shit planned okay there's a birthday party starting at eight and it's gonna be at the house then there's another birthday party at 10 because Xavion is turning 36 yes the big three six he's old as fuck i know and the first birthday party is for nova and namir because high school pack is out and i know we just had a birthday party last episode but we finna have two three more because <laughs> I'm ready to get playing with the high school pack, okay? I'm not trying to play no games, okay? I've been taking my time to get my mental health back right, and it's time for high school, okay? Like, I'm sorry, y'all, for my little hiatus. Y'all probably like, girl, you, you just had a birthday party, now you've been Yes, yes, I am, okay? And will, and is, and do. <laughs> Unfortunately, the shenanigans do not stop there. This is what we got going on today, okay? This is just a birthday party. This is gonna be the kids' birthday party, okay? And everybody's gonna age up to a teenager. We're gonna hop in cast and all that good stuff. And then there's a grown folks' birthday party for Xavion's Big 36 at 10 o'clock. And then tomorrow is prom, okay, y'all? And you know prom. We gotta do it up big. We gotta eat up the looks. We gotta do everything, everything, everything. So the prom episode, might not be that long, but I'll hop in cast and, you know, do the outfits and everything. Because right after prom, there's a house party. Yes. Yes, there will be a house party. Teenage house party. And I'm so excited for that. But I think we're going to save that for Nova and Namir's spinoff episode. Y'all know what I mean? Because we got to get rid of the adults and, you know, do all that good shit. And then the day after that, there is a rehearsal dinner because... Xavion and Peyton have been engaged for years now at this point and their kids are going to be teenagers which is going to be so perfect for the wedding. The day after that on Monday there's a bachelor party. I guess it's just batch but um gender neutral type shit but the kids are going to be at school and Xavion and Peyton and all they friends are going to go to the nightclub at 3 a.m. Okay so the kids are gonna be home alone right now they're kids but they're gonna be teenagers okay so 
If your parents left the house at 3 o'clock at night to go party, what the fuck you think gonna happen when they gone? <laughs> Y'all already know the vibes, okay? And on Wednesday is the wedding ceremony. So we're gonna jump straight into this. We're gonna just have fun at the fucking, what is this called? Carnival? Festival? Whatever you wanna call this. I would call this a carnival because, you know, they got rides and shit. You know, the roller coaster and shit work, but... <laughs> We're here with a bunch of people that you guys probably don't recognize. This is Keyshawn. Y'all already know who Keyshawn is. One of Javon's um, little... Y'all, speaking of Javon, I know a nigga just like this in real life. He got so many kids, he could build a basketball team with them little niggas, okay? And <laughs> this is Keyshawn. Y'all already know Keyshawn is Javon's son. But this is Mariana. Don't ask me why she's wearing this Maxis Match outfit, please, because I did not have the energy to change them before I recorded this. But this is Xavion's niece, Mariana. And then this is his nephew, Quan. Don't clock me for the names, y'all. Please don't. I'm from California. And this is Mariana, okay? Don't get Mariana confused with Mariana, okay? Because they got different daddies, okay? Her last name is Bullahardes. <laughs> And if y'all watch Proud Family, y'all already know where I got the idea for these names from. But yeah, her last name is just Hardez, okay? Not to get confused with her little sister. They got different daddies, okay? Real ghetto shit. Y'all already know the vibes, okay? And then everybody else here, y'all already know. So let's just jump straight into the carnival and having fun and shit. Unfortunately, the kids can't ride like the carousel and stuff for some reason. But I came prepared. There's like this little um, little arcade over here that they can play with for $1. It's so fucking cute. And then there's this little video game thing that they can play. And then Nova can get on the swing. And then there's like water balloons. Have a water balloon fight with... Yeah, let's do that. Oh, okay. Y'all already know what time it is. <laughs> if you guys forgot, Xavion be popping pills and shit like that. So it says that he's tripping. It says Xavion has an epiphany. Time is everywhere. Time is a tangible item for our brains. Sims are time. Yet the Sims that truly live in the present do not have any concept of time. Every Sim has an ego. This me what? <laughs> I'm sorry. This means that in effect, truly present Sims do not have any concepts of ego. Okay, I'll give him that one. What is he tripping off of? Oh, see, yeah, he over there tweaking out. Y'all know how Xavion do. Oh, Jesus. Oh, y'all, Xavion shaved his beard because y'all was hyping up Xavion's head way, way too much. Like, y'all think Xavion is so cute. And I thought that he would look a little bit uglier without his beard. And I mean, I will admit that I was wrong. Puerto Rican niggas, light-skinned niggas, you know, y'all know how light-skinned niggas are. Y'all was hyping Xavion's head up way too much. Peyton didn't like that shit. Peyton didn't like that shit at all. Speaking of Peyton, Peyton's at home. But uh, Keyshawn is going to be a big part of Nova and Amir's Let's Play. Because I made this in myself, I think, a long time ago, I think. And y'all see the material, please. Like, okay, please. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, y'all see the material. Ah. <laughs> but back to the little kitties. Oh, the birthday party is about to start. Y'all, we didn't have no time to do nothing at the carnival. Man. Okay, well, we'll definitely make up for it by having a good party because it's party central tonight, y'all. All right, y'all, we are back at the house, back at the Streeter family residence. And yes, Miss Cocaina is still staying with us, okay? We'll get into that later. But please get into the drip. Xavion, thick neck ass. <laughs> His neck is too thick for the chain, but this little Betty Boop shirt is by Complex Sims. If you guys want to get cute CC like what I have, I get a lot of shit from Complex Sims. And this shirt is so fucking cute on Xavion. And then y'all know we got Big Choppa in the building. You know, big money. Anytime we have a birthday party, we make sure we invite this nigga. And other people are coming. But these are, um, you know, these are Nova Demir's cousins, Juan and Mariana. And Mariana is still at the fair. That's fine. 
we're gonna go ahead and get the shit started for this party, okay? We're gonna have Georgia make a cake. Hold on. Oh, wait, there's already a cake made. Okay, perfect. So let's go ahead and just like, what is she scared for? Oh, from fear of death? What? Georgia scared to die? Since when? It's that coke, y'all. Cause she don't got no reason to be scared to die. Girl, please don't do too much. Okay, where is everybody? Peyton? Everybody, oh, Big Choppa's performing for the kids. This is Anija. And this is also one of the twins' cousins. This is a new character. I made her myself a very long time ago. Please get into the face. Don't play with her. She is not one of them. This is Anija. Y'all will be seeing a lot more of her in Nova and Amir's Let's Play. But yeah, please don't play with her. Look at her. She's not one of them. And then over here, we have Dominique in them. Keyshawn and Malik just pulled up. It's going to be a whole little situation, y'all. Oh, Diana came. If you guys watched the last episode, you know Diana is a lawyer that be doing coke. Her daughter should be coming soon, too. Everybody is showing up for the babies. But um, I'm going to age them up because we got to hop into cast, y'all. And I don't got no time to waste, okay? Okay, so it's really cute. It has this little thing. When you click on Nova, it says birthday girl. And when you click on the mirror, it says birthday boy. That shit is so cute. But Georgia's still over here running around like a crazy lady. Y'all see her? Look at her. Oh, this is Arturo. Okay, this right here is Arturo Hendrix. Y'all haven't met him before, but this is actually Antoine's little boyfriend, little boyfriend, Ting Ting. Yeah, y'all, all inclusive. We don't judge over here, okay? But yeah, I, I've had him for a while. This is his little, like, boo ting a ting And um, they have a daughter together, actually. They're, like, where is she at? If she shows up, I'll point her out, but she's not here yet. Antoine is here. Keyshawn is here. Everybody's here. But I'm going to go ahead and just age Nova up, y'all, because this shit, I'm ready. Where is it at? More choices. Age up Sim. Household. Where's Nova? Hold on, y'all. Let me figure this shit out and come back. Y'all, there is a lot going on right now. I kind of regret inviting this many Sims because Avion's still tripping. It says, Avion suddenly thinks that watching electronics feels fake, boring, and annoying. Interacting with the world in all of its realistic glory feels much more enjoyable. The world is suddenly at one with Xavion and everything flows gently. Tell me why Xavion is literally having a spiritual awakening and what is he tripping off of? Because that's exactly what it's called. I had a spiritual awakening and girl, I thought I was going crazy. Let's see. Oh, yep. LSD, acid, shit that we don't do. What's this? Has to pee from low bladder. Oh, shit. He's going to piss himself? Okay, y'all. Too much is going on. We finna cheat and we just finna hop in the cast real quick. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. Because they, they got a whole lot going on for some reason. <laughs> All right, y'all. We are about to go blow out this candle and we're going to have Nova go first because she's the firstborn by like 10 minutes. Okay, just go with the flow. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and just blow out these little candles real quick. Let's pretend like everyone's saying, like this is a black people party. Okay, y'all, y'all know black people always be having way too much going on. Nova there we go are you gonna age up y'all this is the shit i be talking about my game is so broken there we go all right are we gonna age up all right we gonna go ahead and just age. you know y'all know what we finna do we finna jump in the cast because I don't have time to be playing with this game, y'all. They be doing entirely too much. Everything always broken. Like, we, we don't have time. <laughs> we got a whole nother birthday party to get to. Alright, so we are in cast. 
Oh, Georgia unlocks the people person lifestyle. Cute. All right. Well, we're going to make Nova a teenager. And I think we can keep some of these traits like Bebe Kid. Ooh, Chile, guess who just hit another lick? You did. You've been beating up everybody in the neighborhood since he was eight months old, fresh out the pamper. And honestly, she looks like a Bebe Kid. You can tell Nova bad as hell. And I wish that we could have played with them more, but I'm kind of like not trying to waste time on my high school ideas because other people will do them first. Okay, okay, so this is what we're working with. All right. The body isn't bad. And we already knew that her body wasn't going to be bad. But the face, mm, the face is not giving. We're going to have to fix this. Because I fully planned on Nova being a bad bitch, just like her mom. So we're going to have to, we're going to have to work with this a little bit. It's not bad, honestly. I've seen worse. I have. But the face, she kind of does have Peyton's face shape. Huh. All right. Let's go ahead and go into skins. We're going to make this real quick and simple because I don't see her needing way more work than some people. You know what I mean? All right. Her chin's a little too pointy. Her lips are a little too big. Alright, right there. Hair. I don't even know what kind of hair I want her to have. Oh wait, y'all, okay. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do Nova and then I'll just come back when she's done because I gotta work my little magic. Y'all already know how it go. All right, y'all, this is what Nova is looking like so far. She's in her little, what you call it, so I don't want to show too much, but this is what Nova is looking like. And y'all, she came out really cute, y'all. Super freaking cute. I think I might give her a belly piercing, but she is the perfect combination of Peyton and Xavion. Like, she looks so cute. So we're going to go ahead and get into the traits. All right, y'all. I'm sorry for the little tidbit. Tell me why my game crashed right in the middle of the party, right? And this is a little story time that I'm just going to slide into the motherfucking part, episode, whatever you want to call it. So my game crashed. I go to my auntie house, right? tell me why my brakes went out on my way home right so i'm already pissed i gotta take the bus back to my man's house tell me why this crackhead gonna come up to me like he knew me with some fucking ice cream in his hand y'all when i tell you i cussed this man out i i'm blue i'm completely blue like y'all i don't even want to finish the fucking part now but i'm gonna finish it just not tonight i have to tell y'all about this shit y'all if y'all make it to this part and y'all hear about this story time, please comment below because I'm completely blue. Car broke. Almost broke this nigga face. Like, y'all, I can't win for losing. <laughs> I'm fighting demons. <laughs> Alright, you guys. It is literally maybe a week after I recorded all of my other footage. It's like a week later and the game has been pissing me off. Like honestly, if y'all wanna know like, oh my gosh, where are the Let's Plays? Where are the LPs? Where's Coco? Like I know y'all miss me or whatever. <laughs> but this game has been pissing me off. I'm playing offline right now and I'm hoping that the fucking game won't start acting up. But you know, beggars cannot be choosers. <laughs> It's currently 2.49 or 2.50 on a Tuesday. And of course, Xavion is the only one awake. Peyton is sleeping. Namir is sleeping. Nova is sleeping. And this is our cousin, Mariana. I introduced y'all to her. She's staying with us for a little while. Her story is nothing interesting. You know, I told you guys that Xavion's Puerto Rican and his brother, not his blood brother but you know you know how niggas be his brother was like hey my block is hot can my daughter stay with you for a little bit and you know Xavion's a real nigga so of course he was like yeah 
of course mikasa sukasa you know only four words that i am like 100 percent confident in mikasa sukasa type shit <laughs> But yeah, I don't really have much planned for the day, but I do have stuff planned on the calendar. I'll show you guys in just one second. So this is what our calendar is looking like. I know we have like a whole bunch of wedding shit planned, but my game would not stop crashing. So we just gonna have to, you know, roll with the punches, I guess. But it's Tuesday, football team sports day. I think I'm gonna have Namir try out for football or boxing or something, you know, so I can make a trait to go with it, you know all-star all-american ooh claiming it i'm gonna make an all-american trait for cheerleaders for track you know for all sports you know just all-american but tomorrow is senior skip day and i made this a holiday myself don't ask me where i got it from you literally just click on like you know where is it add holiday make your own little holiday tomorrow is senior skip day so we're not going to school today or tomorrow but you know our parents don't have to know all that, but I, I have plans for Novendamir. I do. We're going to go to like this huge little house party. Matter of fact, we should plan the party now. Just so that we don't have to. It's senior skip day tomorrow, so let's go ahead and do an event. And let's see. Should we do house party or dance party? Yeah, we're going to hit the clubs. Ugh, we can only invite these people. Gross. Who wants to party with old people? Okay, y'all. I'm gonna get the house party planned. Don't worry about it. But for now, um, it's 3 o'clock in the morning. And I think that Xavion should stop working out. Oh my gosh, Xavion been losing weight, y'all. Y'all see him? Y'all see him? Xavion, been, I had him shave his beard. Y'all was gassing his head. Think that, so he, he was thinking that he was fine. Alright, with the beard. And I got, I thought that, you know... If I took the beard away, he would be less attractive, but I think I was wrong because, you know, I don't have any ugly sins. You know, we don't, we don't do ugly, <laughs> but I think that we should put a door right here so that we can get into our little weed farm. Yes, all my doors are severely broken. Don't comment on it, but yeah, I'm going to have Xavion come in here and, you know, just harvest these plants i know y'all see all these weeds and shit growing on his weed plants he cannot sell this shit period okay all right xavion in here taking care of all his little plants i love watching men do manly shit like yes please mow the lawn please harvest some vegetables all right let's harvest all the weed and then we're gonna make some pills on the pill presser look at it i wish my weed farm was this dope y'all i mean i don't have a weed farm please because people be federal as hell i don't have a weed farm but like, i wish i had one like this what about these come get these exactly all righty then oops sorry that was my ps4 <laughs> All right, we got Xavion over here finna press these little pink Rolex pills, whatever pink Rolex is. And then I'm gonna have him press some Adderall. And yeah, we just gonna watch him cook up shit in the kitchen. Oh my gosh, please don't explode the basement, Xavion. <laughs> but yeah, I think that my playing style is gonna, you know, just kind of change a little bit because... With this teen update, I found that you have to just kind of watch your sims do their thing, you know? Like, they have a lot more autonomy than they used to have. Which, I mean, personally, I don't hate it because I can just sit and talk to you guys while Xavion presses drugs and, you know, does illegal shit. Which is definitely a vibe for me. I don't know about for y'all. <laughs> but I'm perfectly content just watching Xavion do criminal shit and, you know, play along with y'all. But anyway, oh my gosh, Xavion, not you smoking a blunt when you, not you smoking your own supply, please. Oh my gosh. Xavion, Xavion is trying to turn his life around, y'all. He's only smoking weed and he's selling everything else, which is good because he has his niece in the house, you know, his his play niece and his babies are growing up and Novendamir has started smoking weed and stealing from Xavion's stash and he hasn't noticed yet. But, I mean, he is setting an example for his kids, and he's not setting the greatest example. But, I mean, 
At least they made it up out the hood. Shit, I'm still sitting up in the hood trying to tell a little story about, you know, a little come up. But, <laughs> okay, so he, he pressed everything. Now we're going to go sell it before everybody else wakes up. All right, well, it looks like Namir is up like an early bird trying to get the worm or like the worm trying to get the bird. I don't know. But I'm going to have him make breakfast because Peyton's still sleeping, I think. So I'm going to have him make breakfast make himself useful i like how he set the table just for where he was gonna eat love that and there's old coffee just sitting around that's how you know you have teenagers the house is always dirty but yeah. oh my god look there's another cup on the floor my sims haven't been able to eat for some reason i can't make them eat so i've just been cheating their hunger peyton is still sleeping Mariana just drank a mimosa. Mariana, let me find out. You just sat here and drunk that mimosa. I'm gonna have <laughs> I'm gonna have her come upstairs and shower in one of these little showers. This house is so big, y'all. All right, yeah. I'm gonna have her come up here and take a brisk shower. Nova is getting her beauty sleep, so I'm gonna let her just sleep because yeah oh my god nova's room i forgot to show you guys nova's room i'm done decorating it this is what it's giving okay what do y'all think i think that the posters were a very nice touch and then there's a gigantic little elephant right here <laughs> so cute and then she still has her little brats posters and everything else like that yeah it's really cute she has some money because y'all know she is spoiled right next to her little birth control pills. Yeah, we're going to have to start taking them real soon. Y'all already know. And then her little closet area with all her little bags. And then more bags. And then fucking, I don't know, chill pills. I don't know what those are for. But I gave her the wicked chill pills for her period. Because she was spazzing on everybody. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. Nova was on one when she got her period for the first time. It was not cute. Oh, look at Xavion and his son. Oh, oh, bonding. Not really. Xavion has no emotions. Ugh, Xavion. Come. You know what? I'm going to have Xavion do manly shit. I'm going to have him fix the toilet. We're not calling a plumber. Xavion, your kids are about to graduate high school. So I'm going to need you to do some manly shit. Repair the fucking what you call it. But yeah, y'all, nothing's been going on in this world. I have a lot of other save files where there's a lot more shit going on. But today, we're literally just going to skip school, smoke weed, whatever. Did he fix it? Ah, oh, let's scavenge for parts. What's Namir doing? Oh, he's going to the bathroom. Namir, are you high? What is this? THC overload. Namir can't handle this intense edible high. When did you do edibles? I am so disappointed in these children. And then look at what Nova has in her inventory. Weed, roll-ups, hemp wraps. Matter of fact, Nova, wake up. It's time to wake and bake. Xavion is not a good influence on these children. I'm <laughs> and Peyton, oh, is Peyton up? Oh, Mariana's up, okay. She's using her cousin's computer, I guess. Mariana is so pretty, you guys. I actually love her. She's so cute. A Puerto Rican princess, per. Ugh, a sick Puerto Rican princess. The wig is cute though. Okay, Nova, did you roll up? Okay, bet. Let me pause. Because Nova really be waking and baking, y'all. Like, she be going downstairs, picking her own weed, and like, smoking it, I guess. Because I haven't played with this family in a while. I just aged them up like last week and just left it at that. But yeah, y'all, Nova be smoking weed. She be going through it. She be having attitudes. And she's literally a dad's worst nightmare, you guys. I'm not being dramatic. <laughs> Go ahead and smoke that little blunt, girl. You deserve. You do. <laughs> it's just so, um, it, it's so fucking funny because Xavion does the, she's Xavion's twin and she acts just like him. She is a menace you guys <laughs> i love that school starts in like 20 minutes and namir is just chilling in the pool with his ice on his wrist you know high as fuck on thc it's time to get ready for school 
let's go ahead and let's change our outfit and Mariana's ready for school I don't know about nobody else but you know she's sitting here ready to go to school Nova don't even got no fucking clothes on nope you don't have time to eat you wanted to smoke weed now you're hungry it's time to go to school I'm not finna play with these kids y'all they think they can, they think they can do whatever they want and I'm not finna let it happen here what's a cute outfit I gave Nova a bunch of cute little outfits this is cute she thought she was finna come up in here Ooh, should we go with them yeah we're gonna go with them sorry y'all y'all know how it be this game hates me i will see y'all when we get to the high school okay y'all tell me why we pull up to the school right and every single one of these little hooligans is under the influence of something i was right Mariana was drinking a mimosa, so she's feeling tipsy. Namir is having some type of fucking trippy THC overload experience. And he's paranoid. And he apparently his cheeks are red. I don't know what the fuck he's going through. And Nova, high ass, she's over here stoned on AK-47. And Mushroom, she loves life. It says that Mushroom trip left quite the impression. Nova is in a fantastic mood and simply enjoying being alive. This is Avion's twin right here, Nova. Definitely Xavion's twin them. But yeah, um, since Nova is the only one, and it's, I don't think we're going to play with Namir because he's tripping right now, literally. So let's just go ahead and go to class i guess i don't understand how this works i think this is supposed to be a computer lab so i'm gonna have nova come sit down in the computer lab i guess here i'm gonna get rid of this guy because he's in the way and then we'll just you know watch them come down here oh nova's really hungry shouldn't have skipped breakfast to smoke weed how about that all right we in the computer lab y'all per is this supposed to be our teacher where are all the teachers do we just do our own thing namir what are you gonna do hide okay oh they're finna talk oh look at nova bonding with her cousin this is so cute i love this for them all right nothing too crazy i love the old school computer look though they're literally just sitting here playing video games i'm weak yeah y'all so namir over here basically just like hey what do you think about the new school because you know they're te they're technically going to be seniors in high school but for storytelling purposes like we're at it's hard to explain the sims okay y'all just go with it y'all know y'all wanted them to be teenagers too okay but yeah he's just, he's just chatting her up and he's like you going to the party tonight or are you going to the party tomorrow and nova's like you already know we going i'll make sure i you know do a little pillow trick you know y'all know when um siblings be doing the pillow trick and yeah nova basically like yeah i'm gonna be at the party if you're gonna be there you know we gonna tee the fuck up per where y'all going let me let these walls down Oh, I guess they both go in and go do some type of presentation. This is my first time ever sending Sims to high school, y'all. So I have literally no idea what I'm doing. We're just going off vibes at this point because that's all we have. So, Oh, they're going to go sit in on a class. Oh, I like that. Senior skip day starts tomorrow. Okay. We finna be skipping class. Okay, they acquired the writing skill. Salvadorian culture skill. Okay, archaeology. I love this. This is so cute. Okay, Namir, what can we do? Can we, like, take notes? Or no? <laughs> Throw tantrum. I'm weak. All right, so it's just like a watch and learn type of thing. I love this for them. Is there homework? Can they do homework in class? Oh, he's too uncomfortable. Here, let me just... I'll have him read this little book that he has. Or can they not do that? Oh, they're in social studies class. Okay, so this bitch is actually teaching us something. I live. 
I love this. Hold on, let's zoom in on Mariana and Nova. You look at my studious little babies. And then Namir in the background tripping. Oh my god, Namir in the back of the class literally trying not to lose it. I'm so fucking weak. Nova in there high, paying attention, smiling. This girl don't got not a single thought in her mind. I love her. And then Mariana. She just paying attention with an attitude. I love them. Yeah, y'all. I absolutely love them. I will be back when we're done with school because, like, this is cute and everything, but it's low-key kind of boring. So, <laughs> I guess I'll see you guys at lunchtime, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how this shit works, but I like it. All right. So, Nova and Mariana are in their little music class. And is this a student? Oh, no. This is a teacher. Okay. Oh, Nova has to pee. We should go get lunch right after this class. Namir was in computer lab, but now he's at lunch already. I'm gonna have him order food. What can, what can we get? Tortilla wrapped hot dog, senior lunch, hamburger slider, ooh, fried chicken slider. We are gonna get that, that sounds bomb. And then I'm gonna have these two. Oh, she has to pee too. Their bladders literally go down so much faster since the update, and I don't know why. I know that's right, Mar Mariana. I almost said Mariana. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then Nova over here playing the piano. I know that's right. Cute. All right, let's all go get lunch. Go down here and let's sit together. Oh, she had to go to the bathroom. Okay. Oh, she got to go to language arts class. Why? I'm a little confused on how this shit works. Oh, is lunch already over? Oh, okay. So there's like a time limit on everything, I guess. Yeah, Nova, like, I'm finna go back for my food. I don't know about y'all, but I'm finna go get me a hamburger slider. Period. Keyshawn hit up Nova. It's been a while, Nova. Are you doing okay? Let me be like, yeah. Okay, let me find out that Keyshawn likes Nova. Where did the hamburger go? Why did the hamburger disappear? Oh, are we getting yelled at for skipping class? Wow. Oh, we're getting detention. What? How did we didn't even do anything? I don't want to hear your excuses, Miss Streeter. You're not going, you're not in class, so you're getting detention. You aren't easy to trust. It makes you suspicious. How could you not trust this face? Like, do, are we looking at the same girl? She's so cute. Oh, this is discrimination. It's cause we're black. It's cause we're black. Look, look how she, what? She told us we're not trustworthy. Well, uh, the school day over y'all. We, we going home, leave school early. We finna go home. Bitch, detention. Nova decided to ditch class today. She better watch out for the school staff. No, we're leaving. Nah, we're leaving. We're going home. That was very racist of our school. And we're going we're going home. Matter of fact, we're not gonna go home. We're gonna go link up with somebody in Oasis Springs. Keyshawn. Yeah, let's go meet up with Keyshawn. Where's he at? Keyshawn. We finna go smoke weed with Keyshawn at our daddy's warehouse, okay? Period. Y'all, tell me why we just pulled up to the warehouse, right? And Nova talking about some attractiveness alert. Wow, what a sim. Nova Streeter just stopped what they were thinking about for a moment and found themselves staring at Keyshawn Harden. That man has so many of the qualities that make Nova's heart race as if it were on a cross-country marathon. Their handsome features meet Nova's desires so readily that it's almost as if whatever created such a sim sculpted him specifically for Nova. Keyshawn, this is Javon's son. Nova has a crush on him, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait. Let's talk about our sport. Cheerleading or whatever. Nova is definitely going to be a cheerleader, guys. Definitely. 
Let's talk about organizing the biggest birthday party. This is the, um, I don't know if this comes with the fucking, I don't know if this is coming with the patch, all of these things, but I do have the teen mom, the real teen mod or whatever. Let's spread rumors. Ooh, should we talk about our crush? You know, when people be like, oh, I got a crush on this guy. And they really talking about him. But, you know, he don't know that. Yeah. Should we flirt? Ooh, wait. Talk about woohoo? Yeah. We gonna talk about woohoo. And then let's start flirting. Let's ask him if he's single. Suggestive look. Yup. Accept his advances. Let's smoke some meat. Oh, Nova's hungry again? Damn. Wait, let's roll up. And we're gonna smoke right outside the warehouse. Cause this is our this is our dad's gang. Nova. Wait, Keyshawn Harden thinks Nova Streeter is swell and wants to become best friends. <gasps> Not him friend zoning us. What? What should we do, y'all? Should we say okay? And like we can be the best friends that you know fucking on the low? Should we? Or like not let him friend zone us? Uh, I don't know. Let's let's just say yeah. Okay, and let's go ahead and smoke this blunt cuz that was she just got friend zoned by this nigga. Wow. Nova, you are a bad girl. Y'all see this? Nova sitting here really smoking weed just like her dad. Y'all, I think that this is a good place to end the episode. Not gonna lie to you, I'm kind of sick of recording. And I've been working on this episode for days. So I think I'm just gonna end it here. And get some screenshots of Nova being a hooligan. Okay. This is um, Keyshawn's mom right here. The one that Javon be cheating on with all the sugar babies. That's why she walked like that. Her nigga ain't shit. This is Keyshawn's mom right here. Just walking down the street drunk as fuck. I'm weak. But <laughs> we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys liked watching Nova be a badass little girl at school. Literally the first day at school. She got detention. And she got caught smoking weed by fucking Keyshawn's mom. I don't know y'all let me know what you think let me know if you guys have any ideas for the spinoff episode or the spinoff lp i was thinking about calling it secret life of urban teenagers if y'all have ever seen secret life of american teenagers i was thinking about doing like a little spinoff when i was thinking about doing mean girls but you know i don't know comment ideas let me know what you guys thought about this episode and i will see you guys next time i love you guys bye